Microbes in Human Welfare, slide 4 or part 4. In this, roles of microbe in biogas production and as biocontrolling agent is explained. First, biogas production. What is biogas? Biogas is a term used for collective gases in which main component is met methane. So biogas is a term collectively used for gases including methane, hydrogen sulfide, carbon dioxide, hydrogen etc. including methane, CO2, CO as well, CO2, then comma H2S, etc. produced due to anaerobic process involving methanogens. So biogas is a collective term used for many gases which is produced due to anaerobic fermentation by or anaerobic processing by methanogens. Now coming to what is methanogen or what are methanogens? Methanogens are type of anaerobic aerobic, uh, organisms, bacteria specifically, bacteria found in intestine, intestinal tract as well as sewage we can convert manure which can produce methane and other gases found in biogas so which is collectively called uh, uh, biogas example methanobacterium methanobacterium Methanococcus, etc. I have written, give one example, but I wrote two, etc. Methanobacterium, Methanococcus, etc. Now, what is the raw material used for biogas production? Raw materials used for biogas production include mainly mainly manure or cow dung in bracket you can say cow dung except then that plant and crop wastes these are also used as so so biogas production is mainly done in a uh, mainly uh, is common is common in villages and other rural areas now coming to biogas plant uh, uh, one by one I'll write question then answer what is biogas production biogas production 
is an anaerobic process in which in which methano gens convert organic compounds to produce to produce methane and other gases using manure plant and crop waste as raw material in biogas plant now coming to what is biogas plant or biogas plant like this i'll write and i'll explain so what is biogas plant then biogas plant biogas plant as you can see in the image here it is first thing i must say it is inserted in field so either it's a 10 to 15 cm uh, concrete concrete or it can be a uh, feet deep it can be a concrete dung or sometimes uh, uh, 10 to 15 feet deep uh, hole uh, is made in which the slurry of manure or a sl a slur a slurry uh, substance that is semi liquid type of um, um, raw material is uh, used or uh, raw material is added in uh, this part um, shown in uh, gray or silver whatever you say that color so the raw material is manure plant and crop waste or only a manure that is cow dung so uh, what we have to remember that uh, biogas plant is is 10 to 15 feet deep concrete concrete tank or a hole hole or a pit made uh, in the soil in the soil in which a uh, raw material are added next point it has a floating cover and its height changes with the amount of biogas produced now coming to uh, it has an outlet it has an outlet which is joined with pipe lines carrying biogas to different houses it also has another outlet to remove sludge to remove um, what to say mm, splints uh, to remove spent slurry spent a uh, slurry which can be used as fertilizer
now what else that um, main uh, as I told now coming to the function function of biogas importance of biogas importance of biogas used in used for lighting and cooking in rural area comma can also be used for electricity production or generation of electricity as you can see this is the slurry tank or dung water um, which is uh, what to say this is the gas holder and this is the sludge so the sludge means the slurry or sludge which means the ma mixture of manure plant crop waste along with the water and here uh, this is the digester and uh, this way the gas is that is biogas is passed now coming to the next point that is biocontrol microbes as biocontrol agent first we must know that uh, why microbes are better biocontrol agents than pesticides insecticides weedicides etc now first uh, what is a paste paste is harmful is harmful agents damaging damaging useful plants like crop etc it can also be said unwanted plants are called weeds along with that we must know so unwanted any living being found in or the harmful living beings uh, present uh, uh, which basically damage useful plants like crops etc are called pests now pesticides insecticides and weedicides what are these pesticides are chemicals which kill paste similarly uh, full stop similarly insecticides kill insects and weed sides are used in fields means crop fields uh, in fields by farmers to remove weeds now why uh, basically chemicals chemicals are used as uh, these uh, as uh, killing agents but uh, what is the harmful effect what are the harmful effects they can kill the um, they can kill the uh, what are the harmful effects mainly two types harmful effects are kill uh, all types of living beings including both unwanted and useful ones and number two cause pollution of water soil air and and also cause harm to 
living beings including human beings natural fauna and products of that specific field now why it's better to use biocontrol agent or why it's better uh, why bio farming is far better biological farming or organic farming why organic farming is better because uh, in case of organic farming uh, any chemical agent is not used because any chemical agent is not used uh, natural predation predation is used to control that is minimize minimize the um, minimize the effects of pests pests including insects and others for example uh, for example ladybird which is a common um, what to say which is a common um, beetle uh, ladybird and dragonfly are used to get rid of aphids and mosquitoes then bacilla uh, bacillus thuringiensis often you called ba bt uh, produces bt toxin and uh, when it is uh, spread spray uh, mixed uh, it is available in sachets as dried spores mixed with water and sprayed on vulnerable plants like um, brassicas fruit trees and uh, it uh, harms the larva for example caterpillar now coming to one more example that is trichoderma what is the role of trichoderma it is a free living fungi very common in root ecosystem and also baculovirus which attack insects and other arthropods so like this uh, what to say that um, desirable uh, desirable when beneficial in uh, insects are being conserved to aid in the integrated uh, pest management program so beneficial remove the harmful agents so that's really good better than using chemicals